Hi beautiful souls, it's Tad here today with another Dating the Zodiac Signs video and today we're gonna do the Taurus. So this video is based on my own personal experiences, observations, surveys, and my own insights into dating a Taurus. So yeah, just giving you another perspective into dating a Taurus. So the first thing that you have to know about dating a Taurus is that they take their sweet time. What I mean by this is that they don't just take their sweet time with their relationship. Of course, they do with the relationship. They like to have that foundation built first. But they also take their sweet time with everything, with a lot of things that they do. So if they're like taking a shower, they're really feeling their shower, you know? They're really having a sensual experience with their shower, okay? If they are um, taking a walk, they're really feeling, you know, all the senses that they experience in that moment with their walk. That's what I mean when I say they take their sweet time. Um, or maybe we should just say that they're kind of mindful or in the moment with whatever they're engaging in. Maybe that's a better way to put it. The second thing that you have to know about dating a Taurus is that they want you to look good. This sign is ruled by Vetus and they like to look good. They don't want to necessarily look glamorous like a superstar, but they want to look hygienic look like they've done something to look okay and they kind of want you to do the same like if you're going out with them they kind of want you to be dressed according to the occasion and not out of the occasion <laughs> yeah that's what I mean and they kind of like you to be well groomed a little bit or at least have some kind of a style about you if you kind of don't then they kind of like they're gonna feel like, oh, one of my five senses is not being met in this relationship, and that's my visual sense of visuals. <laughs> the third thing that you have to know about dating a Taurus is that they are kind of introverts at the end of the day. I mean, you can have a Taurus with a lot of extroverted placements in their chart, obviously, but their sun, being in this sign in general, means that they do identify with, you know, being able to do their own thing being their own independent thing without having to be around so many people all the time. So at the end of the day, the Taurus, you know, there's something about them usually that's more reflective. Um, they spend their time doing self-care, you know, at home, doing whatever they need to do by themselves um, to make themselves feel better. You know, they gain their energy by doing self-care. So that's why majority of them are introverts. The fourth thing that you have to know about dating a Taurus is that at a certain time of your relationship with the Taurus, you might experience their explosion. Because Tauruses are ruled by Venus, but they're still the bull. <laughs> so they like to keep things pleasant and harmonious, and sometimes they don't really say what they really mean or what they really want, but they are thinking about it inside, you know, being that introvert as well. And then it reaches a certain point where the Taurus feels like, okay, I've given you so many signals about something that I want or that I don't want, but you did not read up on my signals. <laughs> and when that keeps piling up on them, they keep sending signals, it keeps getting misread, they keep sending signals, it keeps getting misread, the Taurus explodes. And then you'll be like, where is this coming from? And they'll be throwing a fit, they'll be getting really loud at you and things like that. So. On to the fifth thing, which can kind of counterbalance this, is that if your Taurus is really willing to work on the relationship and they're really willing to commit to you and be with you long term, number five is that the Taurus will share everything with you because Taurus does rule the throat. The throat chakra has to do with communication and with expression. So if a Taurus is really willing to work on this relationship with you, they will be willing to share. They will be willing to talk more and open more and not just like have everything stuffed up there in their throat but actually talk about things so they don't have to explode on you. So yeah, they're going to be telling you lots of things about themselves, they're going to wanting to be sure the way they feel, sharing you know their opinions and they can have a lot of opinions that they stuff in there <laughs> that they just, it just comes out. So that's my take on dating a Taurus. If you are dating one, then leave a comment below and let us know what your experiences have been. 
If you have anything else you want to add to this list based on your own personal experience, then also comment below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below to come along with us on this channel. If you've already subscribed, then thank you very much for coming along and uh, watching videos, learning, growing together, and having better relationships with the people around us. And um, that's it, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!